Alright, Kansas got a fish on this time. You know what it is? Uh, no. Hasn't jumped, so it's probably oh, a jack. Oh, it is a little snug. Cute. Oh, Okay. Nice. A little, little snooklet. We've caught a half dozen of these guys, one decent one and a few little. And it's got a little snook. We're throwing pilchards up against this little shoreline. What you got? Oh, nice little jump. Oh, it's a little better than I thought. Leave him in the water. All right, fun little snook. Time to let him go. All right, we're out here first thing in the morning, and I'm throwing my cast net, catching us some bait. Do is I anchor up and I use my little mixture of jack mackerel and wheat bread. Get them all excited behind the boat. Catch them up. Oh, on. There we go. Now you feel on. Fish on. Fish on. <laughs> There, so the bay is alive and well. Yay! Yeah. Rod tip up. That's it. Now use it more rod and less reel. Just pull with the rod and reel down to it. They are biting for sure. Pretty close to every cast. Oh, that's a better one. Oh, hang on. Let me get the net. I am chumming the waters up. You can see the snooker just jumping in there eating the chum. Throwing little handfuls of freebies out there. And they are fired up and basically biting on every cast. This is what live bait chumming is all about. Well, actually, that's what live bait chumming is all about. <laughs> a nice fish. Miss Bonnie. Beautiful snook. Five release. Go. That was yeah. awesome. Nice. Another little bit better snook on here, I think. Yeah, it feels, feels tighter, whatever. Oh yeah, decent one. You don't have to do that when they're when they're close to the boat, just when they're heading for the structure. Nice. That's what we're out here looking for. Nice pretty girl with a nice pretty snook. Beautiful day in Sarasota in mid-October, even though it's like high in the upper 80s, upper 90s. 80s, almost 90. Yeah. But anyway, come to Florida to catch one of these guys. It didn't take long. Instantly, as soon as it hits, they are fired up. We were here yesterday afternoon and found these guys. And they are obviously still here. A little better? Yeah, a little better. Oh yeah, a lot better. Let me get the net for this guy. Watch the motor. Leave him in the water. Yeah. Nice. Go ahead, release it. See what? Oh, well, not a bad one. Small as I thought it was. About the size of most of them we're getting today. Yeah, snook. 
Yeah. Beauty. Pretty snuck. Beauty with a beauty. Cool. Okay, ready? Yeah. Another snook. Take your time. That's a little better fish. I think. No? These things are great fun for sure. They pull hard. They're really aggressive right now. It's early fall. And they are ganged up in this little area. Nice little snooky. It's a tiny bit better than average. Pretty fish for sure. Okay. Ready to go back in the water. Nice. Catch and release. Snook are all catch and release right now. I mean, that's a short fish anyhow, but I pretty much let all the snook go. Got it? Fish on. Fish on. It is every cast. This one every cast. It's been awesome. Whoa. Oops. <laughs> Don't take me in the water, Snook. Oh, that's a good one. I have to, oh, yeah, I got to get the net for that one. It was a polar. <laughs> he almost took me right in the water. He almost pulled me in the water. Yeah, that's fish. a nice one. <laughs> nice fish. For sure. All right, go ahead and let him go. Ready to go back? Yay. Yay! Nice job. Awesome. Well, he's got another one on. This one could be a little better. It's taking longer to come in. Oh, nice fish. This is a much better one. Feels heavy. Might have to run up front. See what happens. No, he's coming back. <laughs> Let him hit the boat. Oh, he's big. He's a big one. Oh, my. He's a big one. There we go. Bonnie with a really nice snook right here on the backside of Siesta Key. Um, just chumming with live pilchards. Really nice fish. Great job, Bonnie girl. Let's get it back in the water. I think we'll go home and eat lunch. Ready? Yeah. Ready to go back, snook? There you go.